the theme was how to get Congress back in the game, if I can put it that way. Congress has, for complicated reasons, taken itself out of modern government in a lot of ways. It's still an enormously powerful legislature. In a curious way, it seems not to realize how powerful it is. It tends to dissipate its authority in non-productive ways. Uh, one of the causes of that is Congress's own doing, and that's creating an administrative structure by virtue of which the larger part of Congress's legislating is done by administrative agencies. Congress passes laws of a very general nature and then delegates to administrative agencies the task of biting the bullets, all the politically controversial things, and then reserves the right to complain when the administrative agencies uh, take their every dirty, rotten, cheap advantage of the license Congress gave it. This game, and it is a kind of game, has been going on now for a rising 50 years. And what's happened is that it's caused Congress not to, caused Congress to, to forget that it's a legislature. Uh, and, and the difference between what Congress is now doing and what a legislature rightly understood should be doing is all the difference in the world. One of the things I said today was that Congress had become, uh, 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 partly by design and partly by accident, the handmaiden rather than the rival of the executive. And it has done so by, by uh, 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 enacting a series of rules and procedures that convert the regime from one of the rule of law into one of bureaucratic expertise. It hasn't done so fully self-consciously. In fact, if you said that to many congressmen, they would sort of be shocked by it, if you put it that bluntly. Nevertheless, they feel that they're on a treadmill, uh, which they can't do much about. Uh, but I think there are reasons to be optimistic about this. Uh, the courts, likewise, have unusually deferred to administrative uh, expertise, including interpretations of agencies, uh, the agency's own authority. So, Part of the trick here is to get the judiciary to stop being so deferential to the agencies and getting Congress to reconsider some of its prior delegations by focusing on issues that are at once politically popular and legally intelligent. Uh, that's feasible, it's politically feasible, it's legally possible, and it's necessary. And I think it can be done.